Hey folks, we're just setting back up again. Uh, we had a freeze and we lost everything. All our settings were reset. So I'm just setting back up again, re repairing everything. I got damaged in the data loss. It's me, Ken Shu MC, with Any Press Broadcasting. Technical difficulties abound. So I was talk, talking to a few people today um, for a few things. Uh, what do we got here? So we're missing lots of data on this, a lot of links. So we gotta put the links back in. Copy and paste is not cooperating. Different background today, different background today. Chat window, what is the chat? Um, we're going to leave the chat off today. We're not going to fight with that. So I'm going to open up uh, Wild West Dynasty. Wild West Dynasty. See if, see if Steam will op even open up now that I got the hardware started up again. So basically what happened is my mouse shut down. It, it quit. Cascading into everything else shutting down. I'm not sure what triggered it all. I lost a bunch of data and settings and stuff. Had to reboot the whole system. Do, and it's updating. It's going to update now. Hey, well, that's doing that. I'm going to check my. Uh, 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 it's not going to let me do anything. Connecting to Steam account. Boogity 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 boogity. Not responding, not responding. Please wait. Ah! Updating, updating, updating. Not responding. I swear I updated this like 
before a stream and it decides to update now. So those of you streaming, know that your updates come at 7 o'clock. Now I was told that my audio is a bit loud. I'm turning it down. Turn that up. Because that was too low. Turn that off. Turn that up. I'm going to have to manually redo that one. It's way too low. Increments of point 0.1 make a difference, make a huge difference. Okay, now it's done updating. Wait a minute. Settings, default library, of course, in the wrong one, wrong default library, come on, acknowledge, thank you, default, thank you, thank you, close, Close. Okay. This computer. Now let's try again. It switches every time it reboots the computer. It switches libraries. Because I don't play off the C drive. I don't play my my C drive is not big enough to store my games. So my Steam library is on the server is on a server in the office for all my computers so my laptop when i move it or it reboots or restarts This is playing, I don't see it. I do not see it. It was here like 15 minutes ago, I had it open. Let me go look at the other computers.
Oh, it says it's playing, but I don't see it. And the, the logo is up. There it goes. It's so graphic intense. It's so graphic intense right now. It drags the system down. And I got an i7 with uh, graphic drivers, heavy graphics processors, and a 2020 system. Specifically designed for gaming. I may drop this, I may drop this game and go for something like Going Medieval. It was running good last, this was running good last time I played but it was so graphically intense. Graphically driver intense. Um, it bites, it bites, it's just not loading. It's taking so long to load. Basically, the time I walked uh, walked away and came back, it still hadn't loaded. The blue bars, like halfway. Okay, I don't have time to play around and waste on on a game that's not going to play. This is what froze up my computer last five minutes ago is loading this game to test the system. I thought it was a mouse. EXE not responding. And it froze up the system again. Okay folks, we're changing stream. Wild West Dynasty is no longer Wild West Dynasty stream. <laughs> you know what? Let's see. Now we'll just pick it up. Hey, did I spell your name right?
Ah, oh, my phone cord stuck under my chair. There we go, now we got it. So this is going medieval, it's early release, uh, early access release. Um, it's on Steam, it's, it's by great folks, uh, new developers, not new developers, but great developers that... Uh, I've been watching other streamers, um, and too numerous to mention. Some are building castles, some are building villages, some are building great ideas, farms. I have a 60 hour farm on it and village. We are going to do a new game. So you can do multiple new games. So like it's got standard uh, settlement uh, experience raids, uh, environmental effects, uh, steady intervals, uh, difficulty adapts to your progress. Peaceful and no enemy attacks, right? So no raids. Uh, traders and that still come in. Uh, choose the game mode if you prefer to focus on construction or settlement. I might just do pe peaceful to do uh, construction, but I, I, I like standard. Survival, it's the hardest difficulty. A lot of enemy raids uh, increase difficulty over time. So you can do these on uh, difficult, different difficulties. There's various difficulties. Let's do... Do we want to focus on construction or, or just game survival? Let's go normal for this this discussion. So uh, you got uh, several starting conditions. You got new life, you got lone wolf, and you got uh, custom. Lone wolf is a solo player, uh, solo uh, settler. Uh, meager resources are the harshest conditions. So you start in winter, you got 20 wood and three package meals, and a buckler and a short bow and a cap and a spear. And you're lucky enough to have a pet called a dog, masculine. New life, uh, you leave the past behind. Uh, there's a tattered group of uh, com with a common goal. I believe, does it say here? Three settlers or five? five um, I think it's five settlers. It might be three. It doesn't say here. You get a whole bunch of resources. And it, these resources are very beneficial. The goats are awesome. The goats will breed and, and produce more goats. So don't kill them. Train them up. Three settlers. There it is. Age range is 25 to 55 years. You try to get uh, settlers to reproduce. So you want a couple of male, a couple of females in the male if you can. Religion, oh, that's big in the game. So this is my my heraldry that I designed, and that's what I stick with. Uh, map type. So you got this is a large map. Uh, it expands when you get into regions. So you got the valley. You got the hillside over here. So you got the valley here, the hillside here, and the mountain top there. Different conditions on each, so you get plenty of limestone, gold, iron, and silver, and lesser amount of fertile soil and clay on the mountain type. The hillside is uneven terrain, suitable for good defense position, fair amount of limestone, clay, and a moderate amount of fertile soil. And the valley is plentiful of vegetation, fertile soil, and clay, and a moderate amount of limestone. Uh, I prefer the hillside myself. 
Now the next thing you get into is map size. Now you get a small map. And the seeds are, you can do a random seed or you can adjust the seed. A medium map or a large map. You don't see the difference at this stage, but I like the large map myself. I like lots of room to play on. Characters. You can re-roll these characters if you don't like them. Stat levels make a difference. Uh, watch this. Passion. Watch your passions. Perks. These are not necessarily perks. They can be detriments too. So Iron Stomach gives modest 40% uh, consumption. 40% less consumption. Right? That's a precious one. Wash out. Uh, rain when rain clouds are about, it's going to be unhappy. Happiness is big in this. Watch your happiness. Industrious. 15% bonus work speed. Good point. Gobbler. Okay, he's always preserved. Always, only way to preserve food is to eat it quickly. They eat everything. 50% food consumption. Duration. 50% less duration. Uh, he's 51. He's a restitutionist. Um... Yeah, you want to be careful of that. You want to balance out your religion. You want. You might want to go all one way or, or balance them out. Uh, terrible character, modesty. So his mining, passion, construction. I like him. I like him actually. Mar, Meg. Meg, female character. 23, okay. Um, early bird, so she rises early. Sleep depletion speed, 25% less. Night owl, 40 winks. Are conflicts. So you don't want any anybody with night owl or, or 40 winks. Or some, some of it. Moribund. Oh, not good not good but she's got passion for medicine you can look at this but this is what you want to look at you want to look at their passions they can learn this if they have this let me look at let me let me look at modesty Culinary and speechcraft. I want somebody with speechcraft for dealing with the traders for getting better buttering. Culinary is good for the cooks. Let's look at Isabel. Construction, intellect, mining, smithing. Okay, she's got good passions. I don't care a whole lot about these skills. This this helps though. Twenty seven skill. Thin skin, nervy. Uh, that might be a conflict. She is 53. She's not going to have kids. Benevolent. Speechcraft. Social interaction. Social interaction. Positive. Okay, you want her. You want her. Listless. Oh, 5% negative social interaction. That pretty balances that out a bit, the speech craft. Yeah. Stout. Temple belly to great X. 
as, as, a, as a great asset storing energy for lean times. Moving speed, five slower. You know what, I'm happy with this group. Um, what are we gonna do? Now her religion is balanced out, it's neither strength, Dosses is neither strength. So we're probably gonna be a restitutionist group. So our group skills passion is construction, intellectual, mining, and speech craft. Okay, but our skills are good. Our skills are where we need them. Botany, construction, cooking, mining, speech craft, and tailoring. That's where we need them. We can grow the rest. So now, this is our, our setup. We got our settlers, our three settlers. We need a standard, normal, a new life, a hillside. Uh, I'm gonna take this tutorial tips off. Now we set up our, our zone. And the first thing I like to do is pause the game when I get in. Tim Horton's coffee, uh, caramel. Okay, so when you get to this, I'm just answering Discord chat. I got voice channel open and I got chat, text channel open. So click to continue, you gotta click, okay, pause. You hit pause by hitting spacebar on, on uh, keyboard, if you got a keyboard. Check these out when you, got, you do your tutorial. Check these out. Okay, so you want my idle. Jobs. Jobs are important. The higher the number, the less likely they to do it. The lower the number, the more likely they to do it. And I said 10 to 1 always at the beginning. At the beginning, I reset this later, increasing the amount number when I want to stop them from doing it. Hunt. So he's a marksman. That's our hunter. You want somebody hunting right away. This is our secondary hunter. So you want to move. Okay, construction. That's our builder. That's our backup builder. Growing. You're going to want fields as soon as you can get them, but you got to research agriculture. So you can ignore that for now. You ignore that for now. Harvest. You, know, you want to get somebody harvesting. Um, Animal husbandry, you got two goats and a dog. You want somebody with handling that right away. Nine, five. 
Mining. You might want somebody to set up for mining. You can set this later. You don't need it right away. I got a good crew of miners. Cut plants. Yes, you want that set up right away. Cooking. You want to cook right away. As soon as you get food. Go in a fireplace and somebody... Oh, battery from the mouse. I stripped down. Uh, crafting... Crafting can wait. Uh, you don't get into this until a little later. But your butchering table is going to need somebody. So you might want to set somebody up for butchering. I like to set the cook up for butchering. Um, who's the cook? Smithing, don't worry about that until you get to forge. Carpentry, don't worry about that until you get to tables and workbench. Uh, woodworking bench, you might want to have somebody. You might have another villager by then, settler. Sewing station and armor table, you usually get the sewing table first. Uh, I do. I do. Um before you got anybody doing that. You want to get research going as quickly as possible. Artists, not, not, no, don't worry about that. So if you see me changing numbers, left click lowers the number, right click increases the number. So if I get a zero, I usually take them right off the map. Stewards, basics like lock, locking doors, closing windows, extinguishing torches. Also setting those things up as well. So you want them, you want them pretty high. Stockpile, burning, burning bodies, burning remains. You want that set as a one. So they do their chores from left to right. So they do this first, this second, this third, this fourth, and work across the board doing the task. Schedule, next important thing. You gotta have a work schedule, you gotta have a sleep schedule, and you have to have a leisure. Leisure is important. I like to put an hour of leisure in the morning, an hour of leisure in the evening, and I like to leave this hour for them to do anything they want. I like to leave this hour for them to do anything they want. Then I give them four hours of work time. Then I let them do anything they want for an hour. You reset this by, by like the night owl or, or whatever by their, their sleep sleep cycles. You reset this for sleep cycles later. That's what I, that's typically what I tend to do, or I could do this. You want them to have leisure time, right? You want them to have leisure time. Managing. They're going to flee automatically, that's default. If you want to know, um, his marksman is 9, his melee is 0, so his weapon is ranged, and no shield. Now you can reset this, you can edit this, right? Go click this, and you go, um, uh, I can want him to do everything, or I can go, he can have the buck. Oh, I forgot. You gotta change that. You gotta click the plus when you change it. So you can do the buckler and the shield. And you rename it. You rename it up here. Up here. There we go. I call this my light shielding. As soon as you click off that, somewhere on the map, it changes this one, right? So that's my light shield setup. <sighs> Docks. Uh, marksman 6, and he's got passion for it. Melee's 5, no passion. So he's my marksman.
Construction boss, marksman 10, nearly two. He's got no passion in either one. Oh, I got no melee dudes. Headgear. You can swap this out. Um, all headgear, no headgear, helmet, cap. I like to edit it. I like to mess with it. You can change the hit points of the headgear so they, they only accept stuff. Say you only want them to have stuff that's got 26% of their hit points or more. You want sturdy or better, right? Now you can do hats. Um, I want caps, wide hats, I don't want crowns, sack hood, headband, kerchief, headscarf, hood. I'm going to create a couple here because I got a sh chaperone. I have no idea what the chaperone is. I, I think that's French word for hat, but I'm not sure. So I close that, and then I go back to headgear. This is your helmet, right? So I'm going to leave this. I do light helmets. So I go in here and I go great helm, big face helm, light helmet, male helmet. So when it gets down to about 25% use, 25%. I can't adjust the, this one, okay. Because it's one of the gear I chose. Okay. I did a typo there in like helmets. Apparel. I changed this as well. So you got winter, summer, no apparel. I added it. Light gear. Oh, right, yes. Um, and the next one, she is no all apparel, no apparel. All apparel. Um, uh, edit. Because my idea, when you say all apparel, that includes shackles. Armor. Light armor, all armor, no armor. We're going to edit that too. Let's edit the armor and then rename it.
And you can do the same with food and stimulants. Stimulants I change like drinks. And sometimes I edit that. Overview. Big, 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 big issue. Domestic and wildlife. So wildlife, this is what you're going to capture or hunt. I set every, each and every animal. So what I like to do is go to animals and set alphabetical, so boars, deer, and so on. I look at the age and, and type. They're all untamed, unnamed. They're all unnamed. Um, boars, I want to tame. They're 20% tameable, right? So you only got 20% tameable. They're going to retaliate 30% of the time. They're going to attack the tamer 30% of the time he tries to tame them. If I try to hunt them, 80% of the time they're going to attack the hunter. Deer. Uh, I want females. I don't want this mature female. See, there's 50% young female deer 50% trainable and 0% chance of attacking back mature males good food source but I want one for taming I want for breeding stock foxes 8% uh, I'm gonna leave them alone no they're a nuisance they're a nuisance animal you could tame them you could tame them and breed them and have a supply for, for furs. Pears, that's another animal that you can reproduce. 60% tameable, no percent chance of attack. Pheasants. Polecats, 0% chance of attacking. I haven't found a use for them. They're, they're usable, but um, they're trainable. They won't attack back, but they kill everything in your stock. Um, I am going to hunt them. They're a good source of leather. Rats. That's a nuisance animal. They're trainable. They don't attack back. They don't attack when you tame them. When you attack, hunt them. They are a food source. I'm going to leave those alone. Wolves. You train a wolf, it becomes a dog. And you can use it for hunting. So deer, uh, boars, cows, and that you can use for labor. Asses and donkeys you can use for labor. Um, remnant control. You want them on remnant control? I, I like to say, set them. Who's our, who's our guy? Who's our guy? Who's our animal guy? Anyway, dogs. Um, you can only assign one animal, one one animal, to, domestic animal to each person. So you can change these around later, but you can only assign one 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 animal to person. So here you got train, slaughter, release. Release sets them free, and they become wild animals. Slaughter, so their food and, and and fur and pelts. Train, you can use them for whatever, but you, once you, like, these become beasts of burden, they, 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 they haul stuff. They do haul stuff, and they do a great job of it. And you don't need to watch them. You just train them, they start hauling stuff. It takes a while to train them, but I want to keep these two for breeding stock, so I'm not going to train them. So here you got your items, your assignments, and stuff. Um, Take that off so they're not restricted. Not restricted. Not restricted. Not restricted. Okay, that's already not restricted. Winter clothes. You want to start making apparel, winter clothes as soon as you can. Resources. Make sure they're not restricted. You can do this here, or you can go into into the game and do it. 
shouldn't have anything in fermenting yet. Materials. Can I do the whole works? Yes. <sighs> God. Cabbage seed. Once you get the fields, you want that unrestricted. You want to feed your donk, you go straight away. And this stuff will rot. I release everything basically. Books are important, chronicles are important for your research. Release that as soon as you can so you can do some chronicle research. Release your medicine. There's one hidden behind here, carcass. Rat carcasses. Oh, lots of dead rats. Who killed all those rats? Um, base value weight fresh, 100% fresh. Um, hit points. We don't have a butchering table, so I'm just going to leave those alone. So you gotta get a research table to get research. Um, religion, you need a cartography table. And a post. Car uh, caravan post. We did that, we did that, we did that, we did that. We're good. So basically, I'll show you a couple more things. So you can scroll out on the wheel and view out or view in. See these yellow ones? They're harvestable, right? You want to start harvesting and don't don't cut, harvest. At this point, you just want to harvest. And this should be flax, yep. You want the seeds, right? Oh. There we go. There's the one that you can harvest. Mushrooms, dirt pile, sticks. You want to get your berries going as soon as you can so they get a food supply because you got no food supply almost. You're going to build a couple months food supply. See, there's five berries in that bush, 12 berries in that bush, 12 berries in that bush, 12 berries in that bush. Don't collect too much because they will rot. Then you want to grab a couple trees. You want some wood coming in. Now look at your stats. Current growth phase mature, 3.4%. 25 sticks. One sapling and 50 wood. You want that. What was this one? Birch tree. 50, 25, 1. That one's not ready. It's dead. It's dead. It's, 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 I just want to clear it. That's mature. That's mature. Be sure it sticks. Tall grass, you want your tall grass for your goats. Start, har start harvesting that. Okay, so look for a building site. This should be clay. Yeah, that's clay. So you want to be near clay. I want to be near clay. You may not want to. This should be iron or what is this? You want a source of wood, you want you want building materials. A hair. Okay, I want the hair. Yeah, 
this limestone? Coal. Okay, coal is cool. Iron, yep. That's cool. Look for limestone. Dirt. Coal. Clay. There's lots of clay, a lot of coal. Lots of dirt. I don't see much limestone. There's some rock. There's salt. More clay. That's over here. Coal. Iron. Coal. Coal. Iron, iron. Limestone. So we do have limestone. Okay, we have limestone close by. What? Where's my crew? There's bone pile over there. I'm a bit con concerned. There's not much limestone. Yeah, I'm gonna harvest these. Just because I want to clear this space. That's dead. It's, it's losing value. I want to clear this space for building. If you wonder how I did that, it's. Um, I'm moving around the board with the was but I um this scroll wheel of the mouse if you click down on it and hold it you can you can you can do this scroll wheel of the mouse And you use that a lot. I want to be. Oh, I want the mushrooms too. They eat the mushrooms for. For you use the best mushroom I've seen was six. And that was a rare occasion. You usually see four or five, a full-grown mushroom patch. That's sapling really, so... Okay, so we go down here, we go to zones, right? All right, current stage in this, uh, your current default uh, starting stage in the game, you have the default stockpile, the dumping style, and the warfare. You're going to want to use all three of those as soon as you can set them up. Um, first of all, let's clear. There we go. So you're going to build buildings around these eventually, maybe. I want to stock all this close. What's this? Rocky soil. So this is a warfare pile. Look at my space here. The warfare pile. Eight by nine, eight by ten, nine by ten, ten by ten. Then what I do is I click on it. I like to rename things. I'm, I'm bad for that. Mm 
No, Bellstock. Um. Carcasses. That's where I put my battle stock. Then you want your food stock and your building stock. Waste. You don't want to travel. You don't want to be traveling too far. I'm gonna put my waste next to my battle stock. My dump ground. I don't want it too close to my clay. But I don't need a big. I don't. Uh, I don't need a big one. I need basically seven by seven. That's uh, seven by six. Carcasses. Uh, waste. Yeah, that's perfect. Now I build a couple. I'm gonna build in. I'm gonna be building my structures right here. My supplies are right there. And the food, food's basically here and here. So I don't want them to travel too far between those. I want to check. There's clay there. Dirt, 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 Rocky, rocky. Okay. I'll be building structures over these eventually. Now my mine, my mine pit for my for my root cellar is going right here because I saw that was a small one. The root cellar is going right here, and what I like to do is put a. zone over it. So let's name this one. Got one, medicine. Oh, you know, I forgot to set the priority. I set it for high because uh, it's pretty much all I need. Let's go over these two. This is a food one. I set this to very high. Food. The root cellar is going to be a deep pit. I'll show you what I'm going to do with it as soon as I get this set up. Let's set up, pre set up.
got one more to build. Oh, I might as well do this while I'm here. There, I'm happy now. Where's my general pit? General stock. I said it slightly lower. I said it medium. And I clear it all. And I go apparel, carcasses, food, material, seed, water, books, medicine, trophies. I do not put waste in my general storage, I do not put my warfare, and I do not put my fermenting ingredients there. So that's, that's, the, that's the zones. Now to do the buildings. We need a building before nightfall, so we gotta make a small, sturdy structure for some beds. So this is basically what you start out with. So you start out with wall, floor, door, window, uh, wooden stairs and th and roofs. So you don't want to build anything two stories yet until you get into so our temporary building. Our initial building will be right here. So I like to lay the floor first. So you, initially you have a choice between wooden floor and wicker floor. Um, the second floor, if I build a second story, is a uh, I like to go 12 by 12. It gives me room to put furniture in. And because my guys, I don't want to start with limestone or sandstone or anything or clay. So you got clay or, or, or uh, wood. Wood's quicker. You can build your main structure out of something other than wood. If you, if you want to. My barn will have a double door, barn doors. The doors, you got a whole bunch of choices, right? You got, you got your wooden door, you got your wicker door, you got your grated door, which is more secure, you got barn door. If you got the iron, go for a grated door, but if you don't have the iron, go for wicker or wooden. I use wicker doors on the interior, wooden doors on the exterior. That little half circle is your swing radius. That's your swing radius. Now, if you want to swap it, oh, didn't work. Q and E. It's not going to let me. Doors seem to be right-handed. Windows. You basically got two types in the initial setup. You got clay and you got wood. And it generally swaps around to, to fit your design.
Now, sadly, building structures do need pillars for roofs. And you want to research table as soon as you can. So you put your research table in. I put it right. Like I'm gonna put it right there. Campfire for cooking. You want a cooking campfire as soon as you can. The the arrow indicates the approach. I I plop two down just so they got so I can have two cooks going. A butchering table. You want a butchering table. You don't want it too close to your cooking because of the cleanliness. See how it blocks the door? Should probably not put it inside. People like light. People like a table to sit at. And seats to see that. So you got um, wicker table, stool, or wooden stool. Uh, I go straight for the wooden stool. You get three people, I put six seats in because you will increase population. Uh, a, a brazier, you start with clay, you do get a stone one later. It does have a facing. I just haven't figured out what the best facing, facing is. Let's go that way. Beds. He's got two beds to start with it. A wicker bed and a hay sleeping spot. Hay sleeping spot is quicker and you always have the hay to do it. And if you got sticks you got the... You need at least three beds to start. I, I like to put five or six in. Then you got the... Leisure activities, you want a leisure activity, at least one. Um, can I swap, where can I stick it? Let's put it right there. Restitutionist, we have a restitutionist. I like to stick it where they can get easy access. Now I'm going to put an oak brethren just because I put it a little ways away so they don't conflict. They build those as quickly as they can. Graves. You have a marked grave, wooden marker grave, and a sarcophagus. I don't bother the sarcophagus right away. I, I put a grave marker and I marked, I put the graves a little ways away. I'll show you something once they're done. I put some unmarked graves in too because um, you're gonna get attacked if you put on a standard setting. You want corpses laying around. You want corpses laying around. Merchant stalls. Your merchants have no place to go. They're a little cranky. Put it anywhere. You can build it. Move it afterwards. Um, this I put over here. I swap it a bit if I can. I like to smack two of them in there. You, there's settings once you get them built.
Yeah, got that, got that. Fence and gate. You, you goats, your goats need a pen. I am putting my goats, they're noisy. You don't want them too close to your house. No. <gasps> you, you. Depends how, how you want to do this. See, if I fit it right there, it shows blue, but as soon as I drag it over, it swaps over. Since space is already occupied. So you only got wicker to start with. So you got wicker or stone, stone or uh, wooden gate. I put a wicker. I put a wooden gate in. Again, a, a swing radius, swing. So you can put a double gate in. Like I can take that out and put a double gate. So I got. Two. Don't forget your pen marker. And a trough. You need a feed trough. Uh, this gets variants, different variants later to help out. You can do defenses uh, once you start getting attacked. I think I'm ready to activate my settlers. I have to take a five minute break and I will be right back. I just realized one of my goats is named Doggy. 
Who names a goat doggy? Con is busy building. Just finished the grave. She always hits the grave. The, the construction workers always hit the graves first. So you got enemy corpse or settler corpse. My unmarked graves are always for settler uh, uh, enemies. I want to get this over with as painlessly as possible. So these people should be moving this stuff. Or are they? They're not moving this stuff. The so dock is move, taming an animal. Modesty is harvesting. Finish the graves. Okay, did I get this one? No, I didn't get this one. Yeah, watch them. They get injured. They get injured quickly. They get exhausted. They need a bed. They need a bed. See, she harvested the berries. She harvested the berries. Just put this berry bush up for harvest. Harvesting resources, taming animals. Let's go see what Doc's doing. What animal is he taming? The goats are wandering off. That's why you want to pen as soon as you can. If you click on them, you see they're passing. He's going from one extreme to the other. He's going to try and tame that deer. Oh, he's going right for the wolf pack. So let's pause this. Let's change his course of action. Let's go to his man jobs. Doc is animal husbandry. He just take that off the books. Let's take off the books until we can do something about it. He's gonna go tame that animal, but at least he's not. See your your speed buttons are here, up in the top right. Getting the resources, where is he? He's getting the resources to uh, build the graves. Wood markers. He's taking care of the graves, taking care of the afterlife first. Doing the blueprints first. Modesty, where's modesty? I'm gonna zoom out. Just so I can see where his modesty is. This is my map. It's a large map. If you double click on them, you zoom right in on them. And you get a right click to release. She's, harvest, she's harvesting, but she's not moving. Remember, we took hills. 
You know what? I want to gather these berries. I want some berries. Herbs. Harvest herbs if you can, because that's your medicine. Okay, that's enough harvesting. This, this gets some stuff hauled in. So you see up here, the so clay I got 118, dirt I got 5. If you want to break it down, it's uh, this one. Materials is 125. Rest, rest open. Rest. Oh, I want to take care of this when I can. So again, you got enemy and settlers. You're thinking I'm wasting resources, right? Before I get too old. Yeah, that one's good. And this, yeah, choice. So if you get a little button here, little, little little logo here, that means you can do something with it. So a mount, so a mount, I can change the mount or I can go forever, right? So burn the bodies forever. The resources, you edit. So enemy or settler's corpses, I do one or the other. And right now I'm gonna do sticks because that's my most abundant. I wanna save the, save the, um, I wanna save the uh, wood and, and not for building. I don't wanna use it for this shit. They're moving stuff into place. Spear. Short sword. Short bow. They're moving stuff now. Okay. Hauling to stockpile. Hauling to stockpile. Auto equipping. Who's equipping what? So if stuff's not counted in this this here index, it's not counted unless it's in, in a stockpile. See unhappy? See modesty's unhappy? Yeah, watch that. They don't don't work as well. This pole cat is coming in for food stealing. He's stealing food. They're pretty organized. See, I got three food now. Did they get the fire pits ready? They haven't got the fire pits ready yet. So I like to keep as much food as I can within a hundred. It rots pretty quick. So if you don't keep at least a hundred, you're, you're gonna lose villagers. You got no beds. Come on guys, make your beds. Con.
He equipped a bow already. He equipped a longbow. Equipped a buckler, but he didn't equip the. Okay. So, docks. That polecat's hanging around stealing our food. So we got 133 food and 5 medicine. Okay, well, I'm happy. Medicine goes bad too, so you don't want to tag along too much. Early game. That's our beer. We got beer now. Or ale. What is it? Ale. Oh, we're closing in our first night. They're gonna sleep outdoors on the bare open ground. These sources for construction. What's dock building? What's con building? We're building fire. Your AI is not that intelligent. Settlers are exhausted. You gotta watch that. You don't want them working too hard. So I'm gonna pause it. Schedule. Um, can make that tree down.
I'm gonna leave that tall grass there. So this grass has come out. One bed, one person sleeping. We gotta get three beds. Then we gotta get somebody focused on the research table. Auto save. So I'm gonna pause it. I'm gonna go into saving. What are we gonna name the You went to sleep under a tree. All the foxes are here. We can tame them or we can hunt them. Cancel hunting. There's a lot of tall grass right there. So what I do for night is I speed it up five times. Bed. <laughs> One more bed needed. When it hits three hours, there we go. What's our schedule? Three hours, four hours, five hours. Sheep are up. Hurry, five food. Eat berries. Eat three, five cabbage. Five packed meals. Three mushrooms. They drank some ale already. Minute clock. 387. What's Khan's issue? What is Khan's issue? Why is he so unhappy? Initial optimism is 25. Um, slept outside. Yeah, they're, they're unhappy because they're sleeping outside. Freaking wolf eating our food. What's he eating? He eats a lot of food. We should be hunting him. Eat packaged meals.
Carpentry and construction, in case he's got some construction skills. That would be real good. Let me get rid of this tree. It's dead anyways. Uh, I want to build this building before I start construction of my main building, like my proper building. And build it in clay. I want to get the third bed built before I build the research station. Faithless master builder. He's got no faith. Is that somebody had re Oh yeah, there he is. It's Tim Horton's coffee's going a long ways. Colin's going to work on the research table. Does he get enough resources? He or she. Please, please have enough materials to finish the table. Okay, so now you see research lit up. So you can unlock agriculture, architecture, and unlock agriculture. That's all I wanted. That's all I wanted. And if you go here. They will produce chronicles forever. Um, that was con. Let's get this butchering table built. Where are we going to put our fields? So if you go to the zones, you now have agriculture. And you have cabbage, flax, barley, herbs, and red currants. I like to get red currants in there as well. Now I'm going to build here uh, my fields. I want the clay there. The cabbage. I got 15 cabbage seeds. So if I go six by five by five is twenty-five, thirty, thirty-six. See that? See how that uh, that material blocked it? Twenty days. You can tell it not to sow. You can tell it to, when to harvest it. That's cabbage field. I want to do a flax field as well. Or a barley field. So, six. Seven by seven. And. And red currants. Red currants work really well. A good food, food source.
want agriculture going as quickly as I can. The summer comes quick. Butchering table. There's two products. There's well, there's raw meat for now. But you choose. So you don't want you don't want corpses. Uh, I don't want uh, carcasses. Yeah. I don't want rat. I don't want cat. There we go. Now Khan has to get these fireplaces going. So we gotta cook this raw meat we're producing. And once he's got a fireplace done, why has he not built a bed? You got 17 raw meat already. We got some entertainment to get for him. Now everybody's got a bed. I gotta micromanage for a bit here. Well, he's doing that. Some people say this is not a way to do it, but it's the way I do it. I get three stools too. This is why I was happy when I got this this construction. What the heck? It's going all the way over there for sticks. Can not sticks closer? Guess not. 
200 food. Okay, now we got enough food. We're doing good on food. So we successfully got through two days. Preparing food, preparing food, okay. Good me, goodness me, goodness me, goodness me. So books, we got 25. We need a whole bunch more. So when they go to sleep for a night, while they're sleeping, I adjust the work schedule. Work man management of jobs. You ruined the harvest. He's not a good harvester. worth harvesting yet. Is Khan built that stool yet? Where is Khan? Give resources for construction. So you get experience points. You got 92 experience points for cooking now. Now he's got some relaxation. We got it covered. Ideally, we put, should put a second one in. No, I don't want it there. Want it there. Can't get lost. Twenty two hours, they should be going to bed soon. He's still going to collect it. He went so far. Holy cow. Is this the lazy? He's exhausted. He's stout. What's this? Boar. Female boar. Who's exhausted? Con. So that tree fall down.
He's got to sleep when he gets back. He's going to build that stool and then go to sleep. Okay, 6 p.m. Okay, I gotta pause it. I missed it. So we gotta get some research going here. We gotta get some more tables built so the con is enjoying entertainment. So we're gonna let him enjoy his entertainment. But we gotta change the job. So tending, con. Who's the researcher? Who is the researcher? I got the researcher set. So we gotta take this off. This off and this off. Six AM. Okay, cool. It's just a schedule. Okay. That's not the one. Who's the early bird? There's our early bird. So we're going to put him to work a little earlier. We're going to change his schedule. We're going to change his schedule. What about modesty? Did, he, did she have a particular sleep schedule? Busy. Gobbler. <sighs> I can put more work on mo modesty. So if I put more work like that and do this. Okay. 
see how people react to that. Let's see if they're any happier. I gotta watch uh, Khan. I want once he's working, I want to put him on a uh, market stall. And his stools. Market stall and stools. Uh, it's a toss up. Market stall and stools or back table. Maybe the leisure have to be a little spaced out. Market stall. Market stall it is. Cook is just busy cooking up food. What's he cooking? Let's stop him cooking fodder. I think he was hungry. He's happy now. He was hungry. She was hungry. Please, oh please finish that stall. You're taking forever. They eventually make friends. Like th there is relationship building in this in, amongst the settlers in this game. Five, five, five. I get three stools. Do I want to build a pen or a back animal team? Do I want to have an entertainment or, or animal set up? I want Marcy hauling. I want Marcy hauling. As far as I'm concerned, Doc can keep cooking. We gotta get one of these. It's that one I want to do. Where did Khan go? Oh, right. So let's click on the, let's show you the market stall. The market stall is 150 points. It's got nothing you, you can interact with. Skill required to uh, work with it is is uh, zero. It works better with cover, cover, 
Um, 20%. The wolves and pole cats keep eating our food. Who's your hunter? Ox preparing food. Where's he preparing food at? I don't see him. Oh, there he is. He went way over there to get buried or something. She. Uh, I, don't, I think they're pretty generic. Oh crap. That's right too. Didn't have a ranged weapon. We gotta get research to get a ranged weapon. We gotta get rid of these pole cats. Oh, that's Caesar Hunter. What's your skill? Marksman 9. I have passion for her, but she's a marksman. Con, Con's just getting back. How's the wolf hunt go? He's coming back. At least if I scare him off, he'll stop eating the food.
How long did I scare him off for, though? Ah. How do I stop them from hunting? Fair enough. Where'd that frame full cat go? I think he's got the longbow too. Here we go, I'm off to hunting. So I want to watch him finish that construction. I don't know how long I scared off the polecats for. Or the wolves. You got pretty homey there. Trying to get that Congo rest. Twenty one hundred hours needs rest. I think he's grabbing food. It's like there's 49 food left. The wolves and the polecats just ate food. I'm 
fill a food pouch. Going to bed, okay. Fair enough. Who's not in bed? That's Doc. Modesty. Where's Modesty? Modesty's hunting. We gotta turn the hunting off. Day three is spring. Like we're on our third day. Ending our third day. I got about 30 minutes and then I gotta go. We're gonna overwork Khan again. They're, uh, they're having bad dreams. He's uh, neutral food mood. Religious activities is deprived of. So we gotta get him uh, religious activities. So that's, that's what we gotta do next. What's his religion? He has no religion. Oh, somebody finished this. So we shouldn't have to go far for sticks now. Doc's playing backgammon by himself. Oh, 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 oh. Fifty two year old master builder. There's a dead tree. We can harvest it before it falls over. We this tree is mature. This tree looks mature, growing. What if we go like this?
Hold it. Let's do that. What's Doc doing? Where are you going for your resources? Okay, that's not bad. Not clear across the map this time. Conan Exiles is something I'm going to get into too. How far? How far? Just down the hill. So they're praying already. So they need the religious activities. I'll get this other one done too. Food is pretty much stalled. So when we get that bed done, we start building the building after we get this. Praying, let him pray, let him pray. Look, Doc's really happy. Doc's really happy. So we got things in it going in the right order. He's hungry, he's eating. I 
I, I like to get my choice of religions. Chasing down sticks. Level seventeen for what for Marcy's? Seventeen for what? What's Doc doing? Drinking, having a drink. Let him do what he wants now. He's dead, had a good day. <laughs> Doc needs. Can't change up. What's con building? What's con building? Building that floor. Pull cat again. Yep. So we are going. Get that friggin' pole cat. Planting, planting, planting. Go. One, three, five. Ten, five, nine. Gardening. Thank you. Get the car crops in.
It's still spring, day four. We can get the crops in now. Now let's see. I might be able to plant some other crops. Yes! I can get my tree harvest going. Field, oak, scratch pine, oak. I used to plant them close together. Okay, let's pause it. Lone travel hawker empties a pack, spread and a selection of other elements on the ground. On the cloth. I buy, sell things. Okay, what were they doing? I was doing this. Now we got oak, we got scotch pine as well. I'll put the pine over here. Just send my priorities. Need some more birch trees spots. Where am I gonna put the birch trees? The Scotch pine?
our plots going here. See, we got more red currents. We want more red currents. Use them in uh, processes later in cooking. Uh, I didn't put much herbs in. I don't need much herbs. What do we open up here? We open up the arch. Okay, cool. We we'll go back to our building here. We can't put one there because of that window. So if we move the window. We haven't built it yet, right? And put the arch in. Now if we go up a layer, we put the roof on. Now roofs, there's different roofs. There's thatch roof, wicker roof, Wooden roof, half roof. I want to turn it. Just get supports. turned it but it didn't stay turned. Well what if we do this? Stuff happening. Let's 
stuff happen right here. It's not gonna let me. So if I go like this, Deconstruct. Now I bet you if I go down That like that. We're good to go. Let's go back down. At 9.45 p.m. in real world, I will go another five minutes. Hey, send anyone frame a merchant. Let's go check the merchant out. He's almost there. When we get to the merchant shed, Who's our speaker?
Basti. What's Modesty's outlook right now? What's his mood? His mood. He's basically happy, joyful, confident. He's going to sleep. I'm gonna wake him up when the merchant gets there. So I'll show you interaction with an agent, bartering. Right now I don't have much to barter. So, the arrow is take, acquire, proffer. So I have 16 ale, one Birch sap I'm gonna use, 15 cabbage that I'm gonna keep. If I chronicles I'm keeping. Curse go deer carcass. You know if deer carcass is gonna go bad, so I'm gonna sell it. Doggy to goat, flax seed. I have four flax seeds. I want to buy the rest of the flax seed. Herbs. So he can carry 105 kilograms. I got him 100. I got him 94. I'm gonna grab some cabbage seed. Uh, right now I'm 58 coins to the good. Barley, barley. Grab the five barley. Grab the five eight feet. He would buy my dog for 114. Fox carcass. Soul. Maple sapling. Hold on. Mechanical components. You know, I don't know if those deteriorate. Mushrooms. Let's get to some of the mushrooms. We got 101. We got one polecat. Cool. Heart to bride. Nutrition 85. Except for, you know what? So far I'm 56 to good, 40. He's one to the good, so I can buy one. Let's sell him some tallow, some stew. Got a sturdy spear. Let me sell some hay. If you don't have this marketing stall, Buttering sucks. Buttering sucks big time. 
Chronicles. I can't buy any Chronicles from. He's got a dog. I want that dog. How do I get that dog? If I go to buy the dog, I'm 116 in a hole. He can't carry anymore. Now I got two dogs. Now I got a dog and a goat. Wait, 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 I got 137, so if I go back, and make it 137. Stew. Hello. I sold him a bunch of this stuff. Oh, what if I keep the mushroom? It's still 105. Basically, so 199 and 159. Okay. Oh, yeah. Great. It's not balanced out very well. He's not going to accept that. So what can I keep that? If I keep the deer carcass, I put some. I put some okay, I put some at 75. But that's... Some of the deer carcass. Let me keep the pole cap. Off from the leather. Deer carcass. We have to butcher the deer.
watching the balance here. He's going to accept that. He just accept that. Get rid of the fox. Accept. So he was joyful, so he's happy. He's doing what he loves to do. So I'm calling it quits there. That's the end. Hope you enjoyed. Follow, subscribe, like. Join our community, join our chat. Be a nice kind community member. See you tomorrow at Qantas, Qantas campaign.